All right, YouTube, what is good? We are showcasing a brand new Sonic Frontiers mod showcase. Let me just get the default music real quick. Oh my God, you can't scroll through music, bro. What? What? All right, anyways, so as you guys know, as always, subscribe to the channel right now. Drop a thumbs up, please, before we showcase this. And let's just show you what we got. So if you guys look down there, we have Kronos Island. You guys see Kronos Island? It's lit. We love Kronos Island. It is, you know, one of the best islands ever. You know what I'm saying? If I do say so myself. Okay. So you guys see right there, Kronos is down there. Mystic Ruins is up here. So we're going to explore the new Kronos Island Mystic Ruins mod. I honestly don't know who made this. Uh, the link will be in the description if you guys want to check it out. But man, this is like Sonic Adventure 3 Remake. You know what I'm saying? This uh, Sonic Adventure 1 Remake, Sonic Adventure 3, whatever you want to call it. We're going to check it out. So we got the train station right here. So they imported this map all the way from SA1. Which, by the way, chat, if you guys didn't know... Greatest Sonic game ever. We all know it. I know it. You know it. Who doesn't know it? So, let's go see what this map has to offer, shall we? So, right off the bat, we got the area where you fight Eggman for that first boss fight. I mean, look at that. It looks great. I would love to do some photo mode up here, but maybe we could do that later. Um, what do we got up here? We got Tails Workshop. Would you look at that? You know what's interesting about this? So, this is what's interesting about the whole SA1 mod showcase thing. I'm sorry, the SA1 level in the sonic frontiers sonic frontiers is built as like an open zone game that's what it's called you know what i'm saying that's what sega calls it that's their marketing for it and if you think about it sonic adventure one is like the original open zone game like that was their philosophy if you think about it hub world you see the hub world right here and then if you look right here we also have well you see the windy valley textures here by the way great attention to detail um we also have the cyberspace level so if you guys look it's really cool that you can explore the hub world of SA1, and then you can go, you know, you see the Guardian right here. We got Ninja. You see it right here. We have Ninja. You can take out the portal. You know, you can take out the Guardians, and then go get the portal keys, and then go do cyberspace. So, in theory, based off of everything I'm seeing, you could actually basically replay Kronos Island just on the Mystic Ruins, basically, with this Mystic Ruins mod. It allows you to do everything. Everything that you want to do, you can do in here. So, look at that. We'll get a portal key. And then we could theoretically go to cyberspace. But there's another detail that I want to show you guys. Other than, like, you know, all the cool... You know, just the fact that we're in SA, SA1 in Sonic Frontiers. Other than that cool aspect, I want to show you guys some other stuff. So, if you guys go over here... Go up here real quick. Look at that. Boom! We're in, literally, the, uh, the Angel Island part of uh, the Mystic Ruins. If you go in here, I think there's another cyberspace level. So, basically... Looks like there's a cyberspace level where all the other levels existed in Sonic Frontiers, which is cool. So we can take out this guy. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Whoa. All right. This guy wants to play games. You want to play games, bro? Why don't, why don't, why don't, why don't we play games? All right. This is a... Who placed this boss here? So, yeah. There's a cyberspace portal here. Listen. I'm not even, I'm not going to bother with this guy. I'm going. I'm just going to run. I'm just going to run real quick. I'm done. I'm done. Okay. I'm done. All right, we're going to run away from this guy. So, yeah, the one thing I don't like about, you know, one thing where Frontiers gets exposed is in SA1, you could do a full, you know, there's full wall running collision. In this game, there's not really true momentum. So, yeah, that was one thing where Frontiers gets kind of exposed, if you ask me. But let's go check out the rest of the island. I mean, this is truly, in my opinion, this is almost the vision that Sega had for this game when it first came out. Sonic Adventure 1, that is. Sonic Adventure 1 is the original open zone game. Sonic Frontiers is just SA2. I'm sorry, SA1, like fully fleshed out you know what i'm saying because izuka even said it himself when sonic adventure uh i'm sorry when sonic frontiers came out like one of their main inspiring forces for this game was sonic adventure one you got the hub world with linear with linear traditional sonic type stages so we got another cyberspace portal up here we got chronos island down there this is like the coolest part i think of the mod is the fact that like we can literally see chronos and it just looks so like it looks really nice you know what i'm saying this just looks really good this should be canon, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is Angel Island, it's floating, so it's like, it should be canon almost. Yeah, we got the Master Emerald. They got a fake Master Emerald here, the Foo Foo fake Master Emerald. I'm surprised they couldn't animate something where it's like moving, you know. That would have been a lot cooler, but it's okay. So if you guys look also over here, you have all the Chaos Emerald Shrines right here. We got one, two, three. There's three of them at least. I don't know where the other ones are, but we got three right there. I don't know if you can fully complete Kronos over here. One, two, three, four. Is there four? Three? Look at that. Look at that. All right. So there's uh, Look at that jump right there. All right. So there's four Chaos Emerald Shrines. Um, one on Gigantos. That's five. And then I'm trying to think of what else. What other ways you can... Oh, God. 
Look at this. This is the best part of this game, too. This is the thing. There's no physics in this game, but sometimes it's really nice to do stuff like this. Weeroom! Look at that. It's crazy that the Angel Island part of the map, I guess, has no collision. I don't know if that's how it is in the actual game, but you guys see right there. I think you can get all the emeralds, though. I think. I don't know. I'm not really sure. I don't know if you could fully do the Mystic Ruins, but it's pretty cool. So let's go down here real quick. And let's keep exploring. So yeah, we got the regular um, little hut over here. I mean, this is just so nostalgic. Because for me, Sonic Adventure 1 is the greatest Sonic game of all time. There's no debate on that, at least. I won't I won't even debate it. I think it's I think it's just a fact. But at least the Sonic gameplay. Look at this, bro. We can really... This is the best... Oh, man. Such, such a good game. This is why I really love this. So this is like me experiencing what a SA... A Sonic Adventure remake could be like. You know what I'm saying? No physics in it, but obviously... Stuff like this is really nice to do. Ready? It's, a, it's that nice mix. We don't have the spam dash, but we have something just as good. We got this. We got the freaking... We got the... Wait, 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 wait. We got this. This is just, almost just as good. Kind of want to explore in here real quick because I've never been able to go in here. This part was always blocked out back in the day. I kind of want to go check this out. Let's go see. What do we got? Acceleration is awesome in this game. Yeah, it's good. The acceleration is nice. All right, so we can't... I guess we can't go that further in, all right? That would take you to Station Square, theoretically, though. So I would like to see... Listen, Sonic Modders. If there's any Sonic Modders out there, hit my line. Let's 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 scheme up some ideas together. Let's brainstorm together because I would love to see more level mods like this. Let's see what we got over here. So this is new. I mean, this was never in the game. I don't know. I think this might even be a custom build or it's from the Windy Valley beta or something. Oh, God. We have another ninja. Okay, here we go. Let's do it, then. So let's do it. Let's do it, then. So let's do it, then. Oh, God. Oh, God. They're trying to take me out. Oh, yeah. They're trying to take me out. Bop. Stupid. All right, so let's see what else. I think this, I mean, I don't know what this is from. This looks brand new to me. Looks like they might have textured their textured in their own uh, their own stuff. So that's pretty cool. But we got some, uh, we got this over here. Oh, and another cyberspace level. Really cool. We have one singular, whatever this thing is over here. Is there anything, anything else over here? Any other level design? Anything like that? Let's see. Okay, we can go up here. And I think that's the end of this. This level for uh, the Windy Valley-ish hub world -y section. Love it, though. I love this, man. This is really fun to explore. This, something like this almost works better than the original open zones in a way. I mean, I don't know. It's just really cool. I mean, Sonic Adventure 1. Pi that's how you know this game was a pioneer revolutionary force of a game. Um, I'm going to go check down here. The perfect chaos fighting area. And what do we got? Oh, yeah. Okay. So there's no collision or anything like that. Or no water. It's just a uh, regular little area. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Worst boss fight ever, though. I will say that boss fight is trash. Let's go into the Windy Valley real quick and see what's going on in here. Let's see what's going on with that. Um, Let's see what's up, man. Let's go check out Windy Valley. Because apparently, yeah, they got the original Windy Valley textured in. So this is the Omega part. Not the Omega. E123 Gamma. Yo, this is such... Yo, this is such a cool mod. Sonic modders. Can we get more of this? I feel like Frontiers is going to be the next Sonic Generations when it comes to mods. Because they got some crazy stuff in this game already, bro. They got some crazy stuff in a short amount of time with this game. All right, let's go through here. The drop dash is a little sus, though. I'm not going to lie. Drop dash is a little sus right now. And so is the power boost. Oh, my God. I almost just died right there. All right, here we go. Ready? Yeah, we're playing the actual Windy Valley, bro. This is such a nice mod, dude. This is so good. Oh, wait. I'm not going to go down there. All right, let's go over here. Can we go over here? We're playing the actual Windy Valley. Like, this is an open zone. This is the true open zone. Like I said before, SA1, the true original open zone, if you ask me. In my humble opinion. All right, there we go. Okay, we're up here. All right, where, where can we go next? Where can we go next? I want to get over to there. Is there a way to make it? Is there a wall I can run up? Because this is where the tornado... That's where the tornado usually is when you're playing SA1. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I think that I think that's everything that's showcased in this mod. Let's see if we can... I don't think we can make it across, though. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Oh, we're going to make it! Oh, we made it! Oh, we straight from the path. That's a nice touch. That's a nice touch. Are we going to make it back? Are we going to make it back? Oh! All right, let's see what else. Oh, my God. Now now we're cooking. Now we're cooking. I don't know if they added momentum for this, like, for the jumps. I feel like there is some some jumping momentum is being carried forward a little bit. But, yeah, that's, that's sick, bro. SA1 is a W, man. SA1 is a W, bro. I don't care what no one says. SA1 is the best game. Sonic Frontiers took a lot of took a lot of inspiration from it. But you really see all that on full display right here. Um, I wonder if there's anything. I think there's one last thing I want to show you guys. One last thing before we end the showcase, guys. 
there's one last thing we got to do since we got tails workshop right here it's only right that we that we really test out the spam dash of sonic frontiers which is the uh air launch the air launch is the sonic frontiers version of the spin dash the infinite spin dash that's all i gotta say and look at that boom we made it back to chronos which is nice but yeah guys that's gonna do it for me that's the mod showcase let me know what you guys think about it let me know you know if you think there should be other sonic levels let me know your, your just your total thoughts about this i'll see you guys in the next one